All right, I just wanted to come on here and give a shout out. Which hold on. Um. I cut the skin up trees right there along the skid trail. Trying to get his job finished up, get it all on the deck. Um, anyway, what was I saying? Oh, uh, uh, oh, I wanted to come on here and give a shout out, sorry, brain fart, to Joseph Bowley. I think that's your last name. I'm pretty bad at last names. Um, he watches pretty much everybody's videos. That's in logging. Thank you for watching all us, Nutsy, and all us on all our behalves. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing to us. Um, and I had a question how long it took me to become a good operator. I'm an all right operator. I'm not going to say I'm a good operator. I mean, I've been running this for about eight years. I've been running this loader. Um, but I've ran so much, I'd rather be good on everything I get on than great on one piece and not be able to run anything. Um, so, but yeah, if I had to guess, if you were on one piece of equipment and stayed on one piece of equipment, about five years, if you were a pretty quick learner. Um, you learn some tricks and be a pretty decent operator. Um, like I said, I've been on this for a while and I can do about whatever I want to with it. So, I hope that answers your question. Uh, there was something else. Oh, uh, I was going to go through the list of equipment that I ran. I ran in the category of log loaders. I ran this loader, a 210E, a 559B cat, a 559C cat, a 579C cat, a Prentice 2384C, a John Deere 437D. Uh, I think that's all the loaders. I think. Um, skitters. I ran a five seven. I mean a five twenty five B or C. A two cat. I mean two John Deere six forty eight uh, G threes. One John Deere six forty eight H. Alright, I'm back. Sorry. A little technical difficulties. I had somebody call me. Um, I think I was on skitters. But that's about all the skitters I've ran. And then cutters. I've run two Hydrax 670s, a Hydrax 711, a John Deere 843, and a Cat 563. Never had the opportunity to run a track cutter. Um, I'd love, one day, I'd love to get on some Tiger Cat equipment. I've never ran anything Tiger Cat. Um, I 
Dozers, I ran my 650. A two Caterpillar D6Cs. And a John Deere 700, I think. Uh, back hose, I ran, I don't know, all the back hose I've ever ran the case. Track hose, I ran a Cabelco 135, which is one y'all see in the videos now. John Deere 200 CLC, which y'all have seen me run. A, what else? Uh, Kubota KX80, a Cat 304.5, a Cat 303.5, a John Deere 35, um, I ran forklifts before, tractors, a bunch of tractors, um, Trying to think what else I ran. I think that's all I can name right now. Skid steers. I can name skid steers if I know. 257B2 I owned for a little while. That Mustang. Two Bobcats. Both of those had wheels on them. I did run one with tracks one time. Um, I ain't a big fan of the Bobcat skid steers. Now, I guess they're okay, they just aren't the most comfortable in the world. Uh, I think that's it. I've owned me, myself, and I with my name on it. I've owned. Uh, two firewood processors. Um, one of those Daddy owns now. Um, two skid steers. A the Kubota KX80. Um, Uh, I'm trying to think what else. That might have been it. And then that John Deere 650 is mine. Our company, my Lord only knows what all that's on. I don't know if I told y'all, but I might be able to get y'all a video of some new Tiger Cat equipment. Uh -huh. I don't remember if I told y'all that in this video or not. Um, but yeah, so, and right now, a, our company owns this loader, a 210E, with, on a self-propelled trailer, uh, two 648G3s, and a two six Hydrax 670s. Two Caterpillar D6Cs, the rear ends are messed up in both of those. Um, and then, I don't know how many service trucks we got, but they're all messed up. So we just, over the years. Um, we've owned, that I can remember, Three Timberjack 360s, or two Timberjack 360s, one Timberjack, if I think it was a 460, it was a bigger one, whatever that was. Uh, Hydrax 670, two Hydrax 670s, a Hydrax 611EX or 711EX, I don't know, these are the ones. That, um, a John Deere 648. G3, the green one, which is a H, just in, with G3 behind it, pretty much. Um, two 648 G3s, the yellow ones. Uh, 
548G2. I won't say is what it was. A 410. These two loaders that we got now. A 410EX. Uh, 210, whatever the one was with the joysticks in front up there. Or not the joysticks, but the levers. Another 210E. Uh, Prentice 325, that didn't stay long. I think that's all we've owned that I remember. I mean, I'm sure we've owned more than that, but that's what I remember. Um, we still own to this day, unless we've sold it to my uncle, a cat with the instead of the hydraulic blade it's got the winch the winches that control the blade um, we probably still own that but it is pretty much my uncle's it's been over there forever um so yeah we've owned quite a bit of equipment throughout the years and that's just what I remember To this day, my favorite skitter we ever owned was the uh, 548. Um, I enjoyed that little skitter. That was a nice little skitter. Um, so anyway, I just figured, and this trailer that I'm sitting on has had three loaders on it. It had that 325 on it. It had the 410 on it, and now this loader. So it's time for a new trailer. Um, so yeah. But anyway, I just figured I'd give y'all a cool little video. Um, give some shout outs. And I'll catch y'all later.